in our bookkeeping and accountancy an interesting subject welcome once again to all of you today we are going to study one more interesting chapter in our subject bookkeeping and accountancy the sir at uh, chapter is analysis of financial statements friends we all know that when we make bookkeeping bookkeeping means recording of business transactions in proper books of accounts whereas accountancy means to summarize analyze and interpret the business transaction that means to find out the results from those books of accounts maintained which types of results the results in respect of financial statements we call it as final accounts we have already studied about final accounts in 11th standard also in 12th standard also final account that means we have to prepare some financial statements some accounts what for for getting out the results from the business activity we all know that any business is conducted or carried out for the sake of earning a profit earning a money for the sake of increasing the goodwill of the business the profitability of the business that is why how it could be studied that whether we are earning a profit or whether we are bearing loss or in which way the business is, is going on so from financial statements from analysis of financial statements it could be found out that whether the business is earning profit or not in which way the business is going what are the ways by which we can develop our business by which we can increase our profitability accountability and so we have to study analysis of financial statements so let us start with our interesting chapter that is analysis of financial statements before that we have to study or see meaning of financial statements the statements prepared to find out profitability efficiency solvency and growth of a business are called as financial statements once again i would like to repeat that statements which are prepared to find out the profitability efficiency solvency and growth or we can say development of a business are called as financial statements some of the examples we all know we have prepared so many financial statements in 11th standard as well as, as well as 12th standard such as trading account profit and loss account balance sheet statement of affairs etc from this meaning we can know that what is what do you mean by state uh, financial statements and why it is uh, prepared then it is prepared generally at the end of financial year we all know that our financial year is first april to 31st march and during this financial year or we can say accounting year books of accounts are maintained various books of accounts that means business transactions are recorded in those books of accounts and at the end of the financial year that means 31st march every year all the books are closed that means all the accounts are closed and trial balance is prepared from the ledger balances and from a trial balance various financial statements and accounts are prepared that means all generally financial statements are prepared at the end of financial year why it is prepared to give complete picture of financial position and managerial performance or we can say overall 
performance of the business to know the real picture of the business what do you mean by picture picture means the real position of a business financial position of business what are the assets of business what are the liabilities of business how much income or expenditure incurred during the year and whether the business has earned profit or bear a loss all the, this picture of financial position can be made or can be get out of this financial statements before that i would like to explain it again for our marathi medium friends mitranno itha pan apla navin prakaran je ahe accounting sir अकाउंटन्सी सर ते आहे अनालिसिस ऑफ फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट्स आता अनालिसिस म्हणजे काय त्याचा मराठी अर्थ आहे विश्लेषण करणे विश्लेषण करायचं म्हणजे कशाचं विश्लेषण करायचं आपल्याला इथं फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट्स जे आहेत आर्थिक पत्रके याचं विश्लेषण करायचं मग अकाउंटन्सी मध्ये आपल्याला माहित आहे की वेगवेगळे फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट्स म्हणजे फायनल अकाउंट्स आपण तयार करतो आपण अकरावी मध्ये शिकलेलो आहोत त्याचबरोबर बारावी मध्ये देखील शिकलेलो आहोत त्यामध्ये ट्रायल बॅलन्स असतो ट्रेडिंग अकाउंट असते प्रॉफिट अँड लॉस असतो बॅलन्स शीट असते स्टेटमेंट ऑफ अफेअर्स असतात असे वेगवेगळे जे फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट्स आहेत ते आपल्याला इथं तयार करायचं असत मग त्यासाठी आपल्याला बुक्स ऑफ अकाउंट आवश्यक आहे बुक्स ऑफ अकाउंट मेंटेन केल्यानंतर म्हणजेच आपले व्यवहार जे आहेत याची नोंद केल्यानंतर वर्षाच्या शेवटी ऍट द एंड ऑफ फायनान्शियल इयर ते बॉक्स ऑफ अकाउंट क्लोज केले जातात त्यावर ट्रायल बॅलन्स बनवला जातो आणि ट्रायल बॅलन्स वर आपल्याला फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट बनवता येतात बर फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट नुसते बनवून तिथे थांबून चालत नाही तर आपल्याला त्या पुढेही जावं लागत त्या पुढे आपल्याला त्याचं अनालिसिस करावं लागत आता अनालिसिस कसं करायचंय आपण ते पुढे पाहणारच आहोत त्याआधी आपल्याला अनालिसिस म्हणजे काय मिनिंग ऑफ फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट म्हणजे काय ते आपण पुन्हा एकदा पाहू स्टेटमेंट प्रिपेअर टू फाइंड आउट प्रॉफिटेबिलिटी एफिशियन्सी सॉल्वन्सी ग्रोथ ऑफ बिझनेस आर कॉल्ड एज फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट आता फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट कशाला म्हणायचं असे आर्थिक पत्रके की जे व्यवसायाची प्रॉफिटेबिलिटी म्हणजे नफा 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 क्षमता त्याला म्हणू आपण एफिशियन्सी म्हणजे क्षमता सॉल्वन्सी आणि ग्रो होत डेव्हलपमेंट ज्याला म्हणू आपण प्रगती हे सर्व मोजण्यासाठी किंवा त्याचा मापदंड निश्चित करण्यासाठी अशा आर्थिक पत्रके तयार केल्या जातात त्याला आपण म्हणतो फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट उदाहरणार्थ तुम्ही ट्रेडिंग अकाउंट बनवता प्रॉफिट अँड लॉस अकाउंट बनवता बॅलन्स शीट बनवता हे सर्व काय आहेत फायनान्शियल अकाउंट आणि स्टेटमेंट ते वर्षाच्या शेवटी बनवले जातात एकतीस मार्च संपल्यानंतर आणि त्याचं जे कशासाठी बनवायचं ते आपल्याला पूर्ण फायनान्शियल पिक्चर जे आहे फायनान्शियल आपली आर्थिक परिस्थिती कशी आहे व्यवसायाची हे आपल्याला इथं ते दाखवत असतात फ्रेंड्स वाय दिस फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट आर इम्पॉर्टंट इम्पॉर्टन्स ऑफ फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट लेट एस सी वेन यू सी सम फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट बॅलन्स शीट a position statement we call it as a position statement why because it gives us a real position about assets and liabilities of uh, a business and profit and loss it gives us whether the business earned a profit or bears a loss so let us see why these statements are prepared or financial statement analysis includes or importance of analysis analysis of data analysis of data why what is analysis of data and or why the data is analyzed it provides methodical classification of financial statements while analysis of all these uh, financial statements it gives us 
the proper information important information about the financial data methodical from which we can classify the information we call methodical classification of financial statement whether uh, the classification whether the accounts are assets or liabilities grouping of the accounts grouping of expenditure grouping of income analysis about uh, costs of the business profitability of the business all these classification methodical classification we can get from analysis of data that interpretation of data that means when data is analyzed that means when we study about financial statements we study about the statistics of financial statements from trading account whether uh, what is the gross profit whether there is a gross loss uh, how much how much uh, purchase is there whether sale is increased or not all these analysis is made out of the data of financial statements and after analysis of the data interpretation of data is made interpretation is to find out the results to explain the results of the data what we get from the, that data what are the meaning what is the meaning of that data so interpretation of data means explanation of meaning and significance of data okay when we prepare um, financial statements from the books of accounts the financial statements we analyze them we analyze trading account profit and loss account balance sheet we compare it with the last year's data we group that data we summarize that data and after that we can come to know or we can explain about, about the meaning and importance of data what exact we get what exact meaning we get from that data that means interpretation of data in this way the analysis is made now you think that uh, why this analysis is made whether it is necessary or not so for that purpose we have to see the objectives of financial statements before that let me uh, explain in short in marathi for our marathi medium friends mitranno ita important financial statements kay ahet mahatvache financial statements kiwa account banu apan ata balance sheet he statement ahe balance sheet a position statement बैलेंस शीट लाटल जता है पोजिशन स्टेटमेंट का कारण बैलेंस शीट है अपने व्यवसाय की आर्थिक परिस्थिति का है रियल पोजिशन ऑफ बैलेंस फाइनेंशियल पोजिशन ऑफ बिजनेस इट शोज रियल पोजिशन ओके प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस अकाउंट इट इज नॉट स्टेटमेंट प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस इज एन अकाउंट इट शोज अस अबाउट इनकम अबाउट एक्सपेन्डिचर about uh, direct income direct expenditure about the profit of a business aplyala te nafa tota patrak asa apan manto tela ye don je aple mahatvache account ani statements apan banavto tayar karto final accounts madhe tyacha analyze ita kele jata visleshan kele jata mag kasa kele jata tar analysis of data pahila kay kele jata त्या डेटाच एनालिसिस केलं जात एनालिसिस म्हणजे काय एनालिसिस म्हणजे विश्लेषण त्या डेटाच विश्लेषण कर मग काय केलं जात त्याच मेथॉडिकल क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट ऑल द इन्फॉर्मेशन इज क्लासिफाईड म्हणजे ग्रुपिंग केलं जात एक्सपेंडिचर देर मे बी एक्सपेंडिचर मे बी इनकम मे बी असेट्स मे बी लायबिलिटीज प्रॉफिट लॉस it provides methodical classification of financial statement that means when we analyze the data apan javas data analyze karto tyavas aplyala tyacha classification itha milat as after that interpretation of data is made tya data cha 
म्हणजे त्या आकडेवारीचं आपण स्टॅटिस्टिक्स म्हणूया त्याला त्याचं काय केलं जातं त्याचं इंटरप्रिटेशन इंटरप्रिटेशन म्हणजे काय इट मीन्स एक्सप्लेनेशन ऑफ एक्सप्लेनेशन अँड मिनिंग ऑफ दॅट डेटा सिग्निफिकन्स ऑफ डेटा त्या जो काही स्टॅटिस्टिक आहे आकडेवारी आहे त्याचा नेमका अर्थ काय आपण बॅलन्स शीट बनवलं वी आर प्रिपेअर्ड बॅलन्स शीट प्रॉफिट अँड लॉस अकाउंट बट वॉट इज द मिनिंग ऑफ ऍक्च्युली दॅट स्टेटमेंट ऑर अकाउंट वी मस्ट कम टू नो अबाउट दॅट अँड वेन वी अनालाइज दॅट डेटा वेन वी क्लासिफाय दॅट डेटा वी कॅन इंटरप्रिट द डेटा ऑर द रिझल्ट आपण त्याला एक्सप्लेन करू शकतो किंवा वी कॅन फाइंड आउट द रिझल्ट ऑफ दॅट एनालिसिस ऑफ डेटा ऑर रिझल्ट ऑफ दोज फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट ठीक आहे इंटरप्रिटेशन म्हणजे काय एक्सप्लेन करणे या डेटा ना ऑब्जेक्टिव्ह ऑफ फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट अनालिसिस वाय फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट आर अनालाइज वाय अनालिसिस इज मे इथं काही उद्देश आपण पाहणार आहोत लेट सी अँड ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ फायनान्शियल स्टेटमेंट नंबर वन टू हेल्प इन प्लॅनिंग इस्टिमेटिंग the earnings of business to help in planning planning up in niyojan karne estimating the earnings of business okay it is very useful to estimate to prepare estimate regarding earning regarding income regarding expenditure regarding the statistics regarding the management that means it helps in planning as well as to estimate about Uh, the activities of business to assist in investment making decisions it assist or board of directors or the superiors or the owners of the business can take proper decisions for investment investment of funds or for any other activity of the business for um, making the business uh, in units more units or to uh, develop the business that means from financial statement analysis the board of directors or owners of the company or business can take important decisions about uh, investment policies or various policies regarding business because we get all the information from financial statement analysis okay then it helps management in assessing the efficiency of the organization how the uh, efficiency is calculated accountability is calculated profitability is calculated from the data available and the data can be available from the financial statements not only from from financial statements but analysis and interpretation of those statements for example how we can come to know about the profit of business that how uh, the board of directors or owners can come to know about the, whether our business is earning profit or bearing loss or whether our business is going on uh, a wrong route how it come to know it comes to know by the way of financial statements analysis of financial statements and so it is very necessary it helps management in assessing the efficiency of the organization again to provide in financial information about economic resources all the resources economic resources for example if any board of director has to take decisions regarding uh borrowing the loan then in that case at first board of director will study about financial statements whether we are in position of borrowing loan or whether we are in position of paying the interest during the year whether we have that much funds or not and all this information will be collected from financial statements as well as from financial statements analysis okay then providing information about changes in net uh, resources arising out of business activities again we can get an information about 
the resources various resources or changing resources maybe assets maybe uh, sale maybe purchase or arising out of business activities whether the business activities are changing we can get an information from these financial statements analysis and to disclose other information that is relevant to the need of users of the financial statement to provide or to disclose the important information to the users of financial statement why because it is necessary for uh, the board of directors for the owner or for the other persons for the customers to know about the financial position of the business and by the way of financial statements and financial statement analysis we can get all this information the mitran aplala financial statements analysis ka karave lagta tyacha kay uddesh hai ki tyacha mule vyavsay cha planning ek niyojan karta yeta estimate tayar karta yeta tyach barobar je व्यवसाय सदर्भर महत्व के डिशीजन है इन्वेस्टमेंट पॉलिसीज आती वेगवेगे कर्जा धोरण सदर्भर वेगवेग् पॉलिसी से तथ डिशीजन्स घर आप मैनेजमेंट जे है यानी एफिशियसी प्रगति है कार्यक्षमता है तक मोजमाप करता अपने कति रिसोर्सेस कि स्त्रोत है वेगवेगे ये अपने कहत प्रकार की महति उपलब्ध होते ही महति जी है हि वेगवेग स्त्रोत अपने तिथ कलता डिस्क्लोज करता मैं बोर्ड ऑफ डायरेक्टर्स आती मालक आती कि सभासद आती कि इतर को अथॉरिटी अपने ही महति देता सो फ्रेंड्स टूडे वी हाव स्टडी अबाउट फाइनेंशियल स्टेटमेंट एंड इट्स एनालिस in the next uh, lecture also we are going to study about the uh, analysis of financial uh, statements okay and uh, for that we have to uh, see the next lecture till then bye